Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to a beautiful single de mile here in uh, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. There's a little show going on. It's for a rep firm for some of the gear stores that do speakers, audio, whatever. Here in Milwaukee at the Comfort Suites, our good friend Rumiko from Pioneer gave me an email and said, why don't you come down and say hi? I got some new stuff I want to show you. Let's go inside and check it out. And would you believe we have even more new toys from Pioneer? This is the DJM 2000 right here. Four channel club mixer with all kinds of effects. More of an install I than anything else. You can do effects on your separate line faders, or you can come over here to this fun pad. Here's where it gets really interesting. Our track is on channel 4, but our effect is actually on channel 3. You can adjust the volume here. What it cranks up, we crank it. The frequency and time. Pretty interesting little beast. But don't expect to see this on mobile. We're looking at more of the install on this beast, but very nice. Of course, up here, we've got the simple buttons that we can hit and do our effects. Down here, we're definitely advanced. Superstar DJ Rumiko is showing us that not only can you use your pad here for effects, and not only can you use your filters up here for separate effects, but you can use them in combination. She's using two at once. So anyway. She's got her wet dry knob on the top. She's got her volume for the effect itself, and then she's got a completely separate effect going on right there on the touchpad. Here's the new 350 series from Pioneer, the DJM350 and the CDJ350. Now there are a couple different things on this than you saw on the 400. First of all, if you take a look here, we've actually got buttons for the effects. So you don't have to use a dial, the buttons are right here for you. Also, you've got this function up here with a USB where you can actually record whatever you're mixing, whatever you're saying on the microphone, and it looks like you can play it back too. And over here on the new 350, here's the feature that I thought was really cool. For those of you who like a visual representation of your music, notice you've got a four bar marker up there. Kind of helps you out. And here I'm using the, uh, the dial, as you can see up there. It's showing you right where you are in the mix as you turn the dial. This also is compatible with the Rekordbox software. Alright, so in a perfect world RCF would really like me. And uh, these are the 10s that they've got out right now, powered, sound beautiful, sound like a 12. They've got a nice mid punch to them. And then we've got this powered sub down here, it's very nice as well, it's a 15, and about a one by two box. Can you imagine something like this to haul around? This is not much at all. Two top cabs and one sub. Of course you could do two if you wanted to, but one would work. It's a 10 inch. Man, it just rocks. Very nice stuff. So there you have it. A quick sneak peek of some things from Pioneer to come and also a quick look at RCF and who knows? Jeff's a really nice guy. He's new at RCF and maybe we can become friends. Cross your fingers, maybe we can take a look at some RCF stuff sometime in the future. But in the meantime, that Pioneer stuff was really nice. The new DJM is going to go for about 2500 bucks, I believe. That's the street price. I thought it was going to be more than that. It's more aimed towards the club, but you mobile guys can get a kick out of it as well. And the new 350 series is coming out real soon too. I believe the new DJM is going to be out sometime in June, I'm thinking. So look for that and I'm sure we'll see more of that at the trade shows to come. So until next time, practice and enjoy. Hope you enjoyed the sneak preview.